The meat only mystery. Can your diet really impact blood pressure? Can a diet solely based on meat actually lower blood pressure? It seems counterintuitive. We've been told for years that red meat is bad for our hearts. Yet the carnivore diet with its focus on animal products is gaining attention for its potential impact on blood pressure. This diet challenges conventional wisdom about heart health. Could this extreme approach actually hold the key to managing blood pressure? In this exploration, we'll delve into the science behind the carnivore diet and its effects on blood pressure. We'll examine the potential benefits, explore the risks, and analyze real-life experiences. Ultimately, we aim to equip you with the knowledge to determine if the carnivore diet could be a viable option for you, always emphasizing the importance of consulting with healthcare professionals. Diving into the carnivore diet. All meat, all the time. The carnivore diet is a restrictive dietary approach. It permits only animal-based products. This means meat, poultry, fish and eggs are allowed. Some individuals also include animal fats like tallow and butter. The reasoning behind this drastic elimination is to remove potential dietary factors that might contribute to inflammation, digestive issues and other health concerns. Proponents of the carnivore diet argue that our ancestors thrived on animal-based diets. They believe our bodies are well suited to processing and utilizing nutrients from animal sources. However, the restrictive nature of the carnivore diet raises concerns about potential nutrient deficiencies. It's crucial to understand both the potential benefits and risks before considering this dietary approach. Meat and Blood Pressure Unpacking the Science and Stories The relationship between the carnivore diet and blood pressure is complex. Some studies suggest that high-protein diets can help lower blood pressure. One way the carnivore diet may influence blood pressure is through weight loss. Weight reduction is a known factor in lowering blood pressure. Removing carbohydrates helps stabilize blood sugar levels, which may play a role in regulating blood pressure. While scientific evidence is still emerging, anecdotal reports provide compelling insights. I was skeptical at first, but my blood pressure improved significantly. I noticed a drop in my blood pressure and an overall better sense of well-being. Weighing the scales carnivore diet benefits for blood pressure. Advocates of the carnivore diet for blood pressure management often highlight several potential benefits. One of the most prominent is weight loss. By eliminating processed foods, sugary drinks, and refined carbohydrates, many individuals experience a significant reduction in calorie intake, leading to weight loss. This weight management can contribute to lower blood pressure levels. Another potential benefit is the diet's emphasis on whole unprocessed foods. By consuming primarily animal products, individuals are less likely to ingest artificial ingredients, preservatives, and added sugars, which are often associated with inflammation and other health issues that can impact blood pressure. While more research is needed to fully understand the long-term effects of the carnivore diet on blood pressure, these potential benefits suggest that it might be a viable option for some individuals, especially those struggling with obesity and related health conditions. Potential pitfalls, carnivore diet risks to consider. While the carnivore diet might offer benefits for blood pressure, it's crucial to acknowledge the potential risks. One significant concern is the risk of nutrient deficiencies. The diet lacks essential vitamins, minerals, and fiber found in plant-based foods. A lack of fiber can lead to digestive issues and disrupt gut bacteria balance. Long-term adherence might increase the risk of deficiencies in vitamin C, E, and potassium. Another concern is the potential impact on cholesterol levels. Some might see an increase in LDL cholesterol contributing to heart disease. Consult with a healthcare professional and undergo regular blood tests if considering the carnivore diet. Salt friend or foe on the carnivore diet. The carnivore diet's impact on blood pressure can be further complicated by the role of salt. Salt or sodium chloride is an essential mineral that plays a crucial role in regulating fluid balance, nerve function, and muscle contractions. However, excessive salt intake is a well-known contributor to high blood pressure. On a typical Western diet high in processed foods, salt intake tends to be high. Processed meats, canned goods, and restaurant meals often contain significant amounts of added sodium. The carnivore diet with its emphasis on whole, unprocessed foods might seem like a lower sodium alternative. However, meat itself naturally contains sodium. Depending on the types and cuts of meat consumed, sodium intake on the carnivore diet could still be significant. Monitoring blood pressure regularly and consulting with a healthcare professional can help determine if salt intake needs to be adjusted. Carnivore diet and cholesterol. Separating fact from fiction. 
The carnivore diet's impact on cholesterol is a common concern, especially for heart health. Cholesterol is essential, but high levels of certain types can increase heart disease risk. The diet's focus on animal products, high in cholesterol, might seem problematic. However, the link between dietary and blood cholesterol is complex. Some report improved cholesterol profiles, with higher HDL and lower triglycerides. But others may see an increase in LDL, the bad cholesterol. Regular blood tests are crucial for anyone on the carnivore diet. Transitioning to a carnivore diet, a step-by-step -step guide. Embarking on the carnivore diet can be a significant dietary shift. It's essential to approach this transition gradually and strategically to minimize potential discomfort and ensure nutritional adequacy. Here's a step-by-step -step guide to transitioning to a carnivore diet. Before making any drastic dietary changes, consult with a doctor or registered dietitian. They can assess your overall health, identify potential risks, and provide personalized guidance. Start by slowly reducing your intake of plant-based foods such as fruits, vegetables, grains, and legumes. Focus on incorporating more animal products into your meals. Choose high-quality, ethically sourced meats, poultry, fish, and eggs. Opt for grass-fed, pasture-raised, and wild-caught options whenever possible. Drink plenty of water throughout the day, especially as your body adjusts to the increased protein intake. Pay attention to how your body responds to the dietary changes. Some individuals might experience digestive discomfort, fatigue, or other side effects during the initial transition phase. Is the carnivore diet right for you? The carnivore diet, with its potential impact on blood pressure and overall health, has garnered both interest and skepticism. Whether this dietary approach is right for you depends on various factors, including your health status, individual preferences, and long-term sustainability. If you're struggling with obesity, insulin resistance, or other metabolic health conditions, the carnivore diet might offer potential benefits for weight loss and blood sugar control. However, it's crucial to acknowledge that this diet is highly restrictive and can lead to nutrient deficiencies if not carefully planned. Furthermore, the carnivore diet might not be suitable for individuals with certain medical conditions, such as kidney disease or gout. Consulting with a healthcare professional and undergoing regular blood tests is paramount to monitor your health and ensure you're meeting your nutritional needs. Ultimately, the decision of whether or not to adopt the carnivore diet is a personal one. Carefully weigh the potential benefits and risks, consider your individual circumstances, and prioritize your long-term health and well-being. Beyond the plate other lifestyle factors for blood pressure. While diet plays a significant role in managing blood pressure, it's not the only factor to consider. Lifestyle modifications beyond dietary changes are equally important for maintaining healthy blood pressure levels. Regular physical activity is crucial for heart health. Aim for at least 150 minutes of moderate intensity exercise or 75 minutes of vigorous intensity exercise per week. Engaging in activities you enjoy such as brisk walking, swimming, cycling, or dancing can make it easier to stick to an exercise routine. Stress management is another critical aspect of blood pressure control. Chronic stress can elevate hormone levels that contribute to high blood pressure. Find healthy ways to manage stress, such as meditation, yoga, deep breathing exercises, or spending time in nature. By adopting these healthy lifestyle habits in conjunction with dietary changes, you can create a comprehensive approach to managing your blood pressure naturally. Join the conversation. Share your thoughts on the carnivore diet. The carnivore diet remains a topic of ongoing discussion and debate. As we've explored, it presents both potential benefits and risks, and its suitability varies from person to person. We'd love to hear your thoughts and experiences on this intriguing dietary approach. Have you tried the carnivore diet? If so, what were your results? Did you experience any changes in your blood pressure, weight, or overall health? What were the challenges you faced and what advice would you give to others considering this diet? If you haven't tried the carnivore diet, what are your initial impressions? Do you have any concerns or questions about this dietary approach? Share your thoughts in the comments below and engage in a respectful and informative discussion with others. Remember, everyone's journey to health and wellness is unique. What works for one person might not work for another. It's essential to prioritize your individual needs, consult with healthcare professionals, and make informed decisions that support your long-term well-being.